Hi, this is Greg with Dark Connect, here with another Dark Connect video tutorial. Today we're going to show you how to broadcast and share your match over the internet. Broadcasting a match is one of the most advanced and coolest features about Dark Connect. As you'll see, it's not hard to do at all, but you do need to have a good internet connection. Broadcasting a match is a great way to share it with friends who can't be there, uh, especially in league matches when a teammate is on vacation. Uh, they can follow the match on their phone, a tablet, PC, or anything with a web browser, no matter where they are in the world. Uh, you can also use this feature as an extra scoreboard if you don't have a good view. See the Dark Connect YouTube channel for lots of examples of how we've used the broadcast feature. The most important thing you need to broadcast uh, and share a match is a good wireless internet connection. If the place you're playing doesn't have a uh, good Wi-Fi, you can also use a wireless hotspot through your cell phone or another device. Dark Connect has an indicator light uh, that tells you if you have a strong enough connection uh, to broadcast your match. Uh, on the right side of the red bar at the bottom, you'll see a colored light. If that light is green, you have a good internet connection. If the light is yellow, then your signal is weak but may still work. However, if this light is red, your signal is not strong enough to broadcast. Once you've made sure your internet connection is good, to broadcast your match, tap the Connect button. This will open up the Connect Options window. There are two buttons here, one for Broadcast Match on DCTV and one for Compete Online. We're here to broadcast, so we'll press the Broadcast button. Dark Connect will generate a four-letter match code, uh, which you can send to any friends via email, text, or other method. All they need to do is use the code at the tv.darkconnect.com website. If you tap the share button, Dark Connect will open up your email client with all the information already filled in. Uh, now that your match scoreboard is all set to broadcast, tap on the continue button. You will now return to the main game screen. Notice how the DCTV code is now displayed uh, just above the internet signal light. Uh, just in case you need a reminder, that's very helpful. Uh, if there are any issues with your broadcast, remember to check here and uh, make sure you still have a strong signal. Uh, now let's take a quick look at the DCTV side of things and what it looks like when you put in a code to watch a match. Here's the uh, DCTV website where it says listings. This is uh, typically reserved for official Dark Connect events uh, such as tournaments. Since we generate our own match code, um, we will go ahead and tap the button that says, I have a DCTV code. Here you uh, just, uh, in the pop-up box that appears, fill in the field with the match code and press continue. Our match code was AJLU. This is not case sensitive. You can put in uppercase or lowercase, it doesn't matter. Now we just press continue. Now uh, it's getting ready for our match, uh, so let's switch back to Dark Connect and start the match up. Let's just uh, say I win the bowl, and it's game on. Let's take a couple of practice turns and we'll see how it looks in the other uh, screen. I'll throw a 95, David of course throws a 60. Back at DCTV, you see it's catching up here, let's see if we can catch it as it's updating. Yep. When your match is over, you can either do nothing or manually end your broadcast. If you do nothing, DCTV will automatically end your connection after a certain amount of time. But if you want to turn it off yourself, just press the Connect button again. On the Connect Options window, you can tap on End Broadcast, and this will also terminate your connection. That's all you need to know about broadcasting and sharing your match online. Uh, we encourage you to try it out the next time you play. Once again, this is Greg with Dark Connect. Uh, visit our website, darkconnect.com, for more information and shoot well.